Hi, this is Ken from Origin Lab. In this video, we'll be covering some of the Excel import features from Origin 2016, including importing Excel files into cloned workbooks, running scripts after Excel imports, and partial imports from the second file on. Origin 2016 supports importing Excel files by cloning current workbooks or importing sheets into saved workbook templates. Here we have two Excel files with three sheets each. To demonstrate these features, let's import one of these Excel files and run it through a number of analyses. Here we see a workbook for day one with its three original sheets, a fourth sheet which combines their figures using the set values tool, a linear fit analysis set up to recalculate automatically with new data, and a summary sheet. Now let's save this as an analysis template. If we want to process more Excel files this way, make sure your first data sheet is active and open the Excel import dialog once again. Let's select the Excel files we want to import and make sure the dialog theme is set to Sheet. This will automatically implement the import settings of our current workbook. To prevent our current workbook from being overwritten, Let's change the first file import mode to Start New Books. The Template Name drop-down list is a newly added feature in 2016, which allows you to load an existing template or clone a current workbook and import data. Here we can see our other Excel files been imported with the same analyses as the previous data. Origin 2016 also supports running scripts in tandem with Excel imports. To demonstrate this, let's make a new workbook and this time select both of our data files. Then, in the column header section, let's set the index rows for long name to 1, and apply this header to all sheets. Under Import Options, you'll find the Scripts subsection allows you to run scripts after each file is imported, or alternately, after all files are imported. This allows you to automate many tasks you would have had to have done manually after an import in the past. Now let's say we have three Excel files we'd like to import into a single sheet that have duplicate identical X columns. Let's run a partial import so from the second file on, we only append the columns with our additional testing data. So let's go back into Import Excel, add all three files, and then in the Import Excel dialog, adjust our row index to one row for long names. And then change the multi-file import mode to start new columns for each sheet. Let's adjust our import options and change partial from none to from second file on. Since we don't want to import our duplicate columns, we'll change the from column value to 2. As you can see, Origin creates a table featuring all of this data with a single column of X values.